So why are people hating on the new movie about the Ghostbusters? Let's get into that right now. Intro! As you all may have heard by now, there is a new movie in the Ghostbusters franchise coming out. It's supposed to be Ghostbusters 3. It's a sequel to the original franchise, not the remake from 2016. And people are saying, well, this new film, it must be sexist because it's not it's a sequel to the, to the remake from 2016 with the all-female cast. <clears throat> um, the success of movies has nothing to do with gender politics. And I do not like talking politics on this channel, but... If the remake had, would have an all-male cast, it still would have tanked because no one asked for a remake of Ghostbusters. Everyone was asking for Ghostbusters 3, the, the end of the trilogy. We did not want a remake of any kind, shape, or form. I mean, look, remakes are fine, but when people aren't asking for them, then they're not supposed to be made. The remake lost 70 plus million dollars, and you're not going to be able to do a sequel to a film that lost over 70 million dollars. It was a flop. It lost money. It got it got good reviews with the critics, but those are critics. They're not people who they're not the general population that go to the uh, to the theater and watch the movie, hoping for a good movie, and then leave with a bad taste in their mouth. <clears throat> so there's, I mean, that's the thing. Politics does not make up money for an audience to go sit to, sit to a movie. I watch movies that I think I like. Like I watched. The Three Stooges movie from 2012. People say a lot of people say they hated it. Well, I think it was good. It made money, so that means it was a hit. The new Halloween movie. Some people hated it because they thought it was too feminist. When I watched it, because I like the Halloween movies, and I think it was a good movie, it made a lot of money. And if it had an agenda, then they kept it hidden really tight. Because I didn't see nothing. All I see was a very good modern day slasher film with set within an original franchise. The same thing they're doing with Ghostbusters. Taking a movie within the original franchise to end that trilogy. They're not going to do a sequel to that remake because it lost too much money. But um, if you, but uh, see, I'm but there again, I don't like remakes. I'm not big on remakes. Now the only remake made in recent history. Subscribe to PewDiePie. Link in the description that I like is uh, the remake of The Little Vampire. I grew up with the original movie from 2000. And the remake, I think was done very well, even though I, I, watched, the, I watched the remake on YouTube in the English version because it was originally released in Germany and I don't speak German. But I, I'm going to be buying it on DVD on the, the English version because you can buy it now in the United States on the, the English version. <clears throat> and I also like the TV series, which I can, which I found the entire 13 episode ser season series from, 10, from 1986 on YouTube. This series. Subscribe to PewDiePie. Link in the description. I will see you all. In my next video. Cheers. Subscribe to PewDiePie.